fellow people of Collingwood College, welcome to another episode of PE at Home with Mel and welcome to my new backyard. Now right over here you can see my new veggie patch. There aren't carrots for me to stomp on but there is spinach and lettuce. So my entire job today is to do some cool bull tricks and also to not ruin the new veggie patch. So yes, today we'll be doing some more bull tricks. I taught you some last quarantine, but today I've thought of some more, so we're gonna try them together. Today you'll need some tennis balls, your body, and some enthusiasm. All right, I'm gonna run through them pretty quickly. I'll give you a demonstration, and then after we finish the video, I want you to go try them out. So the very first thing we're gonna do is pretty easy. You'll need two tennis balls. All you have to do have one tennis ball in your preferred hand and I want you to try to keep bouncing the other tennis ball without catching it just in your hand. So here we go. This is legit the first time I've tried this. Alright, I'll try it one more time to see if I can beat my previous record. It's harder than it looks. Go! Alright, second ball trick. All you need is one ball. You want to throw the ball, you want to kick it, kick it back up, catch it in your hand. It's that simple. Here we go. Don't you love it when I say things are simple and then immediately fail? Oh, you know what? Good thing I've got another ball in my hand. Okay, here we go. Shake two. See? That was better. Simple. Throw it, kick it, catch it. Kick it, catch it. Throw it, kick it, catch it. Throw it, kick it. Oh, I did not catch it. I did not catch it. I did not catch that one. For the people that are way more talented than me at this one, I want you to see how many times you can kick the ball up on your foot in a row. Count out loud, we'll see how you go. I'll try it, but let's be honest, let's not expect too much. One, two. <laughs> one, two. All right, so my record is two. I have to redeem myself. Here we go. Alright, I'm gonna be honest, this last trick, it's really hard. I probably can't do it, which means I also probably can't teach it very well. We're gonna try to juggle with three balls. <laughs> I know I've been really good at this video, so uh, let's see how I do with this one. Pretty much, you hold two balls in your preferred hand and one ball in the other one. With the two ball hand, you're going to throw one up, and as that ball is up in the air, you're going to throw the ball in your other hand. And then, you're going to catch the first ball, throw the third, you know what, I'm going to show you a demonstration, and then I want you to see how you can do it. Because I know for a fact, I know for a fact there are better jugglers out there than me. Alright, get ready to laugh. I'm not going to step on you. Here we go. That wasn't bad, let's try that one again. We might call that one there. All right, so there you go. Three more ball tricks that I'm really good at and I'm challenging all of you to try them at home. Good luck, do better than me. Or just, you know, just try. That's all we can do right now, isn't it? Just try. All right, until next time, stay safe, stay active. Bye-bye.